Penetration tests assess the security of a system or network. They identify vulnerabilities or weaknesses so they can be fixed before malicious hackers can exploit them. Penetration testing can protect against unauthorized access, SQL injections, and brute force attacks. Antivirus software scans files and programs and compares each to a database of known malware signatures. It can quarantine, block, and remove suspicious files to prevent them from harming the system. Anti-malware can protect against all types of malware, including viruses, worms, trojans, spyware, and ransomware. A firewall monitors and controls incoming and outgoing network traffic. It acts as a barrier between an internal network and external networks like the internet. It blocks unauthorized access while allowing safe data to pass through. A firewall can protect against unauthorized access, malware, and DOS or DDoS attacks. User access levels control what users can see and do on a system or network. Users may be given different permissions. This helps prevent accidental or intentional misuse of data and keeps sensitive information secure. User access levels can protect against unauthorized access, SQL injections, and malware. Strong passwords are important for network security as they make it harder for attackers to guess or crack login credentials using attacks like brute force. This helps prevent unauthorized access to systems, data, and user accounts. So strong passwords can protect against brute force attacks, unauthorized access, and data theft. Encryption is the process of scrambling data using a key into an unreadable format so that attackers cannot understand it if intercepted during transmission. Encryption can protect against data interception and data theft. Physical security can restrict access to systems and network hardware. Security can include locks, key cards, cameras, biometric controls, and staff to secure server rooms and prevent unauthorized access and data theft.